I know what you're thinking. Brad, you were level 12 last video. What happened? Well, I messed around a little bit. <laughs> I didn't level up much. Takes a lot. I'm just going to keep sticking to the missions. I did another side mission. It's just some bullshit side quest. And, uh... Been selling weapons, gaining some money. I'll kind of show you what I'm rocking right now. I'm, I'm going to be doing the uh, train to catch mission. Uh, which one did I just do? I don't even know. <laughs> I did one, and it was it was fairly smooth sailing. It did nothing like... I just had to turn on like steam pumps and stuff like that. And uh, currently, this is what I have. Uh, I've been selling stuff, gathering stuff. And pretty much anything I've gathered from anywhere around this area, I've sold. So, anyways. I was waiting to go here. So, where's it at? Here we go. Ho ho! <laughs> well, yeah, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, I know the last few videos, maybe some hair pulling out going on, stuff like that. But uh, I think I think it's gonna be a bright future for this for this set of videos. For one, anything I can. Oh sh! Oh, ho, ho, ho. Holy shit, guys! Did I just find like the mother of all pistols? Hell yes. What's up, baby? This place is just outside heaven for soldiers like us. Always oh, something. Like let me let me stock some stuff up really quick. Let me check my inventory for ammo and everything before I go in there. Who told you about this place? I kill him. <laughs> oh, I got a bunch of that shit. Hell yes. Permanently increase the amount of items you can store in the bank by two. What? Permanently increase the amount of ammo. That's gonna help me. Buy a hundred, Jesus Christ. Uh, I don't think the other stuff's gonna really... Okay. The first few things... Definitely the pistol. I, I, I definitely wanna do that. What is this? Oh. I want that. I'm gonna save the other two. You know where to find me! So now I really don't even have to go sell shit. Yeah, that's I'll, so I got 15, but the ones I just I just got one was a twin peacemaker. Do I have two of those? I feel like I do. Holy shit! This one has so much ammo. I I don't know. This looks awesome. Let me just try it out really quick. Oh. <laughs> it's all like Donkey Kong, guys. Alright. $209. Are you kidding? I got almost three grand, so. Hello? I don't have any work, but that doesn't mean you can't stay. If I tip her, what, what happens? Just nothing? You remind me of my last one. <laughs> Thank you, Name Real charmer. Ah, whatever. Shooting anyone in the face right. if they want to do so. Hello, mercenary person. Chris Venninga, I queen. have money. I dropped him like a bad habit. As it turns out, it wasn't the best idea. Hey, what's her name again? Oh, sorry, sir. Oh, well. No work today. She looks familiar. I'll be damned. Moxie, okay. This is a message to any Crimson Lance left on Pandora. General Knox is dead. And knowing the Lance, they'll more likely cut their losses and leave you here than send an extraction ship. So unless you want to starve to death out there, you got two options. One, you become bandits. Two, you join me in protecting the people of Sanctuary. I can offer you food, shelter, and the chance to fight for something real, something meaningful. A chance I know the Atlas Corporation never gave you. Roland, out. Yes! Soon I'll be selling heck. And now, for the latest edition of This Just In with Hunter Hellquist. A warning to Pandora. The bandit leader known as Roland has escaped from Hyperion custody. Hide your loved ones, store your belongings, and buy the biggest Hyperion gun you can find. 
Roland has been recorded as missing since the liberation of New Haven. He is to be considered dangerous and very, very, very armed. All right. Come back any day. So basically, if you're wondering why I didn't show you this side mission that I did, I just wanted to level up him all in time, but I realized it's going to take a long time to do that. Uh, so I just figured I'd continue with the main missions. And uh, let me sell this really quick. And I just, I don't know, I just kind of wanted to get get some separate stuff going on. So what is this? That looks pretty sweet, but I don't, I think compared to all the other stuff I have right now, it's just not... It's just not going to stack up. So let me get rid of this one really quick. And let me also equip. I'm going to take this one out. Yeah, let me let me equip that. I don't even know if I need three of those. That's the three I'll stick with for now. But yeah, I didn't know if you got... Because I was going to cut out some of like the driving and stuff. But I didn't know if you wanted me to... Uh, this shoots fire, so I'm keeping that. <laughs> I just don't think this is... I don't know. Tempted to sell it, you know? Fast revolver. I think I could get rid of that. It only makes sense. The accuracy, everything else is nice, but... Let me, you know what? Fuck it. Whatever. Good luck. I can part with it for now. I got this thing. What is holy shit? This thing looks sick. So we're back in the main town. I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Just see what's up. Guns. You can never be oh too shit. Well oh my goodness, look at that. I don't need any of this shit either. That's what's funny. I always buy guns you don't need. This is who I talk to. If you could stand still for a moment, I no, that's not it. I, I kind of want to do more side quests, but I just don't know what the what the best ones to do are. I've heard there's some with like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle type shit. It's supposed to be pretty cool. Uh, but I'm gonna just kind of pick and choose random ones. Let me go ahead and go through here. How the hell did those bandits snag you anyway? Oh, I was taking a leak. Handsome Jack is gonna kill us all unless you can stop him. He means hi. That's his way of saying hi. Right. Sorry. Hi. I'll be honest, soldier. We're losing this war. We've been trying to stop Jack for years, taking out his men, raiding his iridium mines, but it hasn't been enough. But you, you met Jack and lived. You fought off the Rippers and the Bloodshots. Saved my ass and Lilith's. Thanks, by the way. If we're gonna survive this, we need your help, Vault Hunter. Now, we thought Jack wanted to open a vault and use its power to wipe us off Pandora. But, thanks to some intel I stole from a Hyperion convoy, I found out we were wrong. What? He's not gonna open a vault. He's going to control it. I'll just go ahead and repeat myself. What? The vault Jack's looking for isn't an alien prison or a cache of weapons. It's a living thing. An ancient Iridian warrior, powerful enough to destroy all life on Pandora. Whoever awakens it, gets to control it. That sounds bad. If Jack wakes the warrior, yeah. But if we control the warrior first... We could use it to wipe Hyperion off the map. No new I'm missions. I'm liking this plan. There's a problem. We need the vault key to wake the warrior, and Jack's already got it. But if you've spoken to Tannis... She didn't vomit when she saw you, did she? She does that sometimes. She might have told you the key needs to be charged with iridium. We're racing against time. Every ounce of that stuff that Jack mines from the ground puts him closer to taking control of that warrior and wiping us out. We gotta get our hands on that vault key. Now, if anybody knows where that key's being kept, it's my spy out in Tundra Express. He's as good at gathering intel as he is at drinking. So I'm sure he's sleeping off last night's booze right now. You'll need to get a fire weapon to wake him up. I'll explain when you get out there. All right, so this should go smoothly. Wanna break some stuff. Oh wow! So I just don't want to take on too many side you missions right now. Weapon. Fire weapon. As far as I know, I I do have one. You know? Yeah, I do. 
I mean, I don't want to equip it just yet, but... Let me see if that does anything different. Yeah. It's definitely a fire weapon. <laughs> I'm starving! The I fuck? wanna eat your babies! Son, this might sting a bit. Oh shit! Holy fuck, that was sick. You need cash? I need things I don't want talked about. Let's talk. Look at this guy. Holy shit. I'm just coming here to, uh... Ooh, how about that? Uh, yeah, I was, I was wanting to uh, do a lot of co-op, but right now I'm just trying to find the different missions and stuff like that. So it's really not necessary, so... I'm just gonna stick to what I know right now, and if it comes to a point where I just can't take it anymore, I'll definitely do some other stuff. Hey, Roland, Handsome Jack here, remember me? My men kicked your bandit asses out of New Haven and killed your little pal Lilith. Ring any bells. Anyway, I hear you and the rest of your little buddies have relocated to Sanctuary. Just wanted to congratulate ya. You've successfully delayed your death by a few months. I'm gonna be real busy mining Iridium to charge that vault key I stole from your buddy Tannis. So you guys are gonna be low on my priority list for a while. So, ciao. Alright. How far away are we? We got a long ways to go? Where is it at? Map exit. Yep, that's the only thing I need to get to. So basically, leave here, take a right, just fall on the right side. Should be pretty straightforward, but uh, we'll see what happens. So yeah, I've been kind of playing this off and on in my own time without really actually recording it. Just because... Uh, just because it's just something I wanted to get more familiar with so I don't look like a complete noob to you guys. But at the same time, it's just, it's one of those games where I don't know if I should show you every single thing, you know? Because I'm just trying to show you the main story right now, and I could definitely show you more, but... The fuck? Oh, hey, buddy! These guys are not a threat. Now, the Bandit Mobile, as I call it, it, uh, it has two things. It has this, the Saw Slinger, or whatever you want to call it. It also has, like, the Exploding Barrel, so... That was pretty fucking sweet! The fuck back! Sorry if I sound a little congested. I'm just... I don't know. I, I guess I'm getting a cold right now. I don't know what's going on. Here's some more of that stuff. No, it's not Iridium. I just pick up any weapon I find until I'm full and then I... I just drop it off somewhere. <laughs> I'm really to test some of this shit out, you know? No, nothing. All right, let's get this, and then we'll get the hell out of here. Nope. All right, we're good to go. I got plenty of money, so I'm not really worried about it. I don't really think I need to stop and get like every box, but I'm like OCD to want to like do that shit, you know. Signal our man. I bet anything he's sleeping off a hangover, so you'll have to wake him up. The sound of some bar kids burning alive at the same time I'm doing. You got a fire gun, right? Welcome to my humble shop. I got a fire gun, so that's I'm good with this. I got Pawn Star playing on in the background right now. I don't know why I watch that show. I don't actually go out of my way to watch it, but it seems like it's always on the History Channel. And I just like seeing the sad people's faces when they're like, it's at least worth a thousand. And he's like, best I can do is six bucks. You know, just, and it's just hopes and dreams just crushed. Ignite. All right. 